Hey everybody, welcome to Chalk Couture Live from the Designer Studio. I am so excited to be live with Katie today in this incredible creative space, talking to you guys about Black Friday. I do love a sale. Do you love a sale? I love a sale. Nobody, oh, there's not anybody who doesn't love a sale. So we're excited, we're excited to be live with you guys. We're coming up on the end of the best Black Friday week in the history of Chalk Couture. We have made so many incredible projects. We have saved so much money on all of our orders and we are just thrilled to be live with you guys today to talk you through another cute little project. We're gonna talk about ink today. Chalkator is famous, fabulous, and fantastic for our paste product, but if y'all don't know ink, you don't know Chalkator. So let's talk a little bit about ink. What are we making today? What are we creating? So we're making some onesies. Um, these two transfers are on sale separately but we're gonna make them together because they go so cute together. Awesome, so um, in the Black Friday promotion if you go to the website chocotour.com you can click on specials and deals you will find these guys in there so they're not sold together but you want to buy them together because look how cute. They're so cute and okay. this one's called the Be Brave and Strong and this one is called Stand Tall. So, so cute. So cute. You ready? All right, let's do it. Okay, okay so great. No um, the really cool thing about ink is it is permanent, so you can chalk on like t-shirts or tote bags or we've even chalked on mugs before and heat set it in the oven. So, so um, cute. So it does have to be heat set. With these, we'll just heat set them with an iron. Okay, so um, tell me though, you've got the um, the ink mat underneath, right? Mm-hmm. So okay. I took one of our lumbar pillow ink mats and I cut it up to fit inside these cute little onesies. Awesome. Um, you have to put something in between so that it doesn't bleed through into the other side. So okay. I placed this one so you guys weren't having to watch me. Um, and so I'm going to go ahead and place this one. It's going to have a backer and it's going to be sticky. And the cool thing about that is it um, kind of straightens out whatever you are inking. Oh, so I want to make sure that the onesie is a, like Yeah, so it's not it wrinkly up. or anything like that. So okay. I'm just going to get this guy in here. And you know what? I am actually going to roll this guy up. Oh, here we go. Insider secrets <laughs> happening right now. That way it's not sticking the whole time. So I used to think that I have like the best job in the whole entire world because <laughs> I get to talk about Chalk Tour and work with all of our incredible designers, but I don't know, it's a pretty good gig you got going on there. It's, it's not a bad job. I'm you just lie. create amazing stuff. All I the craft time. all day. It's the hmm. best. All right, so when you are inking and you're putting these on fabric, you don't want to fuzz your transfers because um, you want it to be as sticky as possible because with ink, you have more chances of um, bleeding. Um, so you want to use, try and use a newer transfer and no fuzzing. No fuzzing, okay. And then I'm assuming if bleeding can be a little bit of a problem, I'm going to try to get that down as tight as I can. Uh-huh, exactly. Okay. So I'm a little, little OCD about it. I make sure it's really down there before I start inking. Okay. And when you do start inking, we try to only go in one direction. So I always just go from top to bottom, that way you, it's not moving around too much, and I always hold on to my transfer to make sure it doesn't move. Okay. Um, what about how much ink? I guess you're going to show us right now. Yes. I, with paste, I'm all kinds of liberal because I know I can just pull off whatever's extra. Exactly. So I just do a little bit at a time when I'm inking. A little bit goes a long way. Awesome. What color is that? This is our shimmer copper ink. It's got a little bit of a sparkle to got it. Got a little bit of a something something a in there. Okay. So I always start off of the silk screen and make my way down and this is fun because it's very sparkly you know it should really be harder than that to make you know like a, a DIY right? homemade handmade incredible onesie I mean you can mm. wear this and, and so you can cute. gift it so we're in the middle of Black Friday it is still it's early enough for us to place our orders to get these and we can make a handful of cute little onesies or all kinds of things, hats. Gosh, people make the cutest little tea towels, all kinds of amazing oh, things yeah. um, with textiles, with ink, and then our um, our transfers. And so they're available. And gosh, what else? All kinds of incredible things are on sale. All of our last chance promotion, our last chance transfers, those are the ones that are just looking at getting retired. So you gotta get that before it sells out. Um, those are on sale in addition to so many incredible transfers like the two that you're seeing right now um, as part of the Black Friday promotion. So go shop. It's not too late. We're getting to the end, but it's not too late. So go check it out. Okay. All right. I'm going to start peeling back and I always peel back my ink really slowly 
just in case something didn't go all the way through, I can lay it back down and fix it. Awesome. Here. Here it comes. Oh, wow. This is always the best part. I can help if you need me to, but you Ooh, gotta give me thorough did instructions. Good. <gasps> Look how beautiful. Got a little shimmer from that gold. I'm not his little paw there. Uh oh. Okay, bit. here's what's magical too about chalk couture. If we saw, we pulled back and we saw that we missed a little spot with the ink. So all we have to do is just lay that transfer right back into place and put the ink on. He's so cute. Perfect. Look at what you did! Look oh, he's, he's cute! Made. He turned out so cute! He turned out cuter than I thought. Alright, we're gonna do our giraffe now. Okay. What color are we doing on giraffe? This is our papaya ink. So that one is not a shimmer. No. Do you have to do anything different with shimmers or does it matter? Um, no, no, okay. they're basically all the same. Um, and then once these are chalked and dry, we like to heat set it with an iron. Four minutes on medium heat um, on each side. Can you do it just directly? Do you put the iron just directly on the, the no. ink or do you do it inside So out? I get a piece of parchment paper. Oh, okay. And put it in between the iron. That way it doesn't get on my iron. And then you get a nice, smooth, clean finish. Awesome. Four minutes on medium heat to heat set. Yes. And then after that, I can throw it in the washer. I can do whatever. Mm -hmm. awesome. Yep, exactly. Isn't that cool? That is amazing. And this dress going to be cute. All right. Sorry, I'm mesmerized. <laughs> I'm supposed to be talking while Katie is talking, but I'm mesmerized by the process. So fun to watch all of this stuff be created. It is cool. And it's so cool because literally anyone can do this. Like, I could never free on this in 10,000 years. <laughs> and it's just here. It's true. You know what? It's fun. I have a six year old daughter. She could do this. If I sat down with her and got her to focus for just a few minutes, that's the other thing that I love about Chalk Couture is I do, I love the idea of being creative. I'm a little bit intimidated by it. So I love that the designs are done and that it's easy for me. And I also love that it's fast. Um, we don't have a ton of time, so it's good to be able to make something magical in just a mm -hmm. few minutes. And I'm always careful with my transfer so I don't stretch. Mm -hmm. That's right. So it's important to peel that transfer from the center versus on the corners, which is kind of our natural tendency. Mm -hmm. That way they don't stretch out. So when you use them next time, he's in perfect shape. This is a good sticky Look transfer. Look at him. Oh my gosh. Heck, he's so cute. Stand tall, y'all. How cute mm -hmm. is he? Woo! That. And then amazing. one thing, just make sure you take out your ink mats before you iron it so it doesn't stick to it. Awesome. But, so yeah. we're going to heat set. So these are done for all mm -hmm. practical purposes. We still need to heat set. Yes. And I would let them air dry or sometimes I'll take a blow dryer to it before I iron it. You don't want it to be still super tacky. Okay. But how much time should I wait? Um, a couple hours. Sometimes I'll just leave it overnight and oh, okay. iron it the next day. A couple hours or leave overnight. Then we iron and heat set. Um, that's, That's way it. too easy. That is super <laughs> way too easy. Can we show them? Yeah. Here's what we made. I didn't make it. Katie totally made it. You guys, how cute are these? <laughs> All right, so we've got one day left, today and tomorrow left, and this incredible Black Friday promotion. You can go and get it back in black, y'all. Both of these promotions are, are, both of these transfers are available as part of this promotion. Gosh, check, a, check out the last chance transfers that are available in that special section. Go to chocotour.com or talk to your designer. Um, get information on how you can get connected with their website. Go and buy some of this cute, amazing stuff and hand make, hand DIY all of your gifts this Christmas. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Katie. Thank you. Bye, everybody. Thanks for joining us. See you tomorrow.